<laughs> that looks ridiculous. Good morning, hello, and welcome back to Daily Diaries. By the time you're watching this, it's gonna be the day before my synchro competition with Matty. I'm still in London in this video because uh, I just moved into the hotel where we're doing our Olympic training camp, being part of the team, which was lovely. And I thought before going into the synchro competition, I'll answer some of your questions. So I'm about to post on Instagram, asking you for some questions because later today, I have to do all my bits and bobs like trimming up my legs. And I think Matty has asked me to wax him. Don't know quite where, I know certain places, uh, but I thought I'd film it and at the same time get him to answer some questions for either me, him, anything about Synchro really, so yeah. So, Matt is here. Hi everyone. Like you said, and I'm going to wax him. Just obviously, every time we go away to a competition, Matty and I share a room because we're Synchro partners. We are currently at the pre camp in Stratford in London. We fly to Tokyo tomorrow, but when you're watching this, we actually compete tomorrow. <laughs> Oh so, <laughs> yeah, but it's still a bit of a way out when I'm recording this, hence why it's way done in advance. So, we're going to be sharing a room when we're in Tokyo, and all the other boys as well, actually, because it's going to be like an, an apartment. apartment. Yeah. But I've screenshotted some of the questions for him to answer while I'm doing his waxing. Yeah, I'm, I'm up to my chest and belly. Just Where do you want me to start? Uh, chest, I think. Okay, and in the middle, like, or? Just wherever you want. Oh, I, I actually hate it, but I like the result. Do you want me to put all the strips on? No. No, no, I'll do no, one at a time. Yeah, one, one at a time. time. One at a time. You can answer the first question. All right. Say you test positive. So we go from the top like this. Oh my god. Say you test positive for COVID a day prior to competing. What would happen? We have to go into isolation and basically get sent home. Are you ready? You're gonna chin me. What? Pull your skin tight. Okay. Three, two, one. Oh, da, 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 da. <laughs> that really hurt. That really hurt. That really hurt. <laughs> Look at oh, that. Good though. Yeah, it really hurt. Look at it. Oink, oink. <laughs> Alright, ready? Ready, three, two, one. Oh, that was a slow one. When you are on the board, how do you both know when to go? Uh, at, basically, on the board, on the end of the board, I say ready, and then Tom will count. So, and then I say, and. One, two, three, go. Does sometimes it bleed like that because of the thickness of the hair? I don't know. I've only done this twice before. Ready? No, no. no. Pull your skin tight. <laughs> one, two, three. <laughs> Is this the leanest, fittest, most ready your body has ever been for a competition? Well, um, <laughs> the fact is, we did our skin folds today, which is the a measure of like the thickness of your skin. And I got a PB. Well, I'm the fat underneath and it. I also got a PB, the leanest I've ever been. So, and which I think works out to be around about just below 5% body fat. Ready? Yeah. Three, two, one. <laughs> That was a good one. That was a really good one. How do you deal with the stress that comes with Olympics? And waxing. I'm waxing. Don't know, I've never been to Olympics. <laughs> <laughs> but to be honest, with stress, it's all about... Greg Luganus once said to me, who's the best diver in the world, he said, fear is excitement without breathing. Boom. When you get scared or worried about something, take a bit of breath. Breathe, be present. Do you go all the way over your nipples or around your nipples? So like you don't want to, you, you don't want to like cover the Fine. nipple. You could go like so it's edges on. Sure, 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 sure. Yeah, two, one. <laughs> oh, that's a good one. Well. Matty, <laughs> Matty, why did you start diving? Why did you fall in love with this sport? I started diving because my older brother, Tom, is also called Tom, uh, did diving, and I was learning to swim. And after my swimming lessons, I'd go watch and dive, and I was like, oh, that looks fun. So. I tried it and I've never looked back since. Um, and don't get me wrong, I was never in love with the sport straight away. I was very scared, I used to cry all the time. Same, uh, by the way. Yeah, but I started to love it when I was, like the friends I made and traveling around the world and, wait, I'm, I'm not ready. No, I know you're not, I'm just getting the tab ready. Three, yeah. two, one. Ha! Do you think a lack of crowds will be, a, will be beneficial or detrimental to performance? Everybody's in the same position. Everybody's going to be worried and wanting the same thing and worried about the same things. And uh, realistically, we've been we always train without a crowd, and we've been doing competitions without crowds all year. So it actually, probably would have been weirder to then go from no crowds when we've been competing to like a massive one like the Olympics. So I think it's going to be a bit of I, I don't think it's going to be that bad of a thing to be honest. No. I'm gonna, their hair's kind of growing this way, so I'm going to go yeah. slightly sideways. Mind the nipple. Mind the nipple between the train and the platform. <laughs> you idiot. Three, two, one. 
That was a really good one as well. I can feel it. Come ah, on. it's burning. I'm actually dealing with this way better than I have. I've, I've only done it twice before and I obviously didn't do it myself. I had someone else do it to me. But also this Q&A situation is probably helping. Ooh. <laughs> Ooh. What do you say to each other when you're walking up the steps to the board? Depends on it. Like, it, what, in comp? Wait, I'm not ready. Are you going? Okay, let me go. Let me go. Three? Yeah. Two. One. Um, ah, I'm stuck to myself. <laughs> like, if, if I want to say something, I'll say it. And I'm not afraid to, like, just have a, like, just randomly say something to Tom, like, and he's, he's the same to, same with Tom. Like, we don't have, like, we're not set in stone, like, you don't talk to each other or anything like that. Sometimes okay. Tom helps me stay in the moment, you know? Three, two, one. Ah. <laughs> what goes through your mind in those seconds before a complicated jump? Um, oh, it can be a bit both. It can be absolutely nothing. And also a lot. I think it depends what kind of mental space you're in, what yeah. goes to your head. Like, m most of the time, like, when you find your, like, true flow, you don't really think about much. You're kind of just it's focusing right. on what you're doing and you're not really thinking about anything. That does take a while to get to that stage. What is everyone taking to keep themselves occupied in the downtime? Knitting! I have brought my Nintendo Switch and I've just bought a... Uh, wait, I'm not ready! Um, I have just bought a... Uh, uh, Animal Crossing and I love it! Right, ready? Yeah. Three. Two, one. Ooh. Ha! Ready, one, two, three. That looks ridiculous. Hi, Tom and Matt. How many per person in an accommodation slash room there? All the best. Uh, so in the Olympics, like we, I think we mentioned before, um, it's a, a we'll be in a boys' apartment. Just Me, back. Tom, Dan, Jack, James, and Noah. Ah! Will you all compete together, or will each team compete in a different place? We will all compete. In together. the same place, yeah. yeah. In the same pool. We have done virtual ones, obviously, yeah. this year, where we have competed in different pools, but... But, the, yeah, the Olympics are all going to be in the same facility. We obviously, we like to be able to... It's, it feels more like a real competition when you do that. Ready, three, two, one. <laughs> oh, that got it! Look, uh, if you look at this nipple, there's a hair under it. <laughs> Do the trunks have any room for movement? Not really. No, you don't really want too much movement. But you don't want movement because when you spin around, you don't want anything moving, getting, getting squished, because it might get squished in between. Sometimes you do get a bit of squishing. Is that my armpit? No, it's not your armpit. One, two, three. Oh, that was good. Look at my chest, how red it is. Very good feeling. This was 2016 Synchro Partner, and this is 2021 Synchro Partner. Yeah, I'm just a better looking one with a bigger set of arms. <laughs> How much does it hurt? Hey, that won't hurt very much. I can't it's gonna hurt. Three, two, one. <clears throat> but look, I've got more. Ready? One, two, three. Mm. Okay, okay, okay. Right, how many condoms do you normally get without using? There is a whole lot going on about that. Mm. Okay, okay. Boys, how many condoms do you get in the Olympic Village? You pick them up, as many as you want. There's a big bowl of them I'm everywhere. I'm going to take the bowl. <laughs> there was a vending machine last time. Because if you think yeah. about it, it's literally like every, your athletes that have been pent up training and not really been like, especially with COVID and stuff like that, for a very long time. It's a big shame. And then COVID everyone's finished competing and it's, you know, everyone's happy. And we have a more... Oh, that was a real big one. But yeah, we're not allowed to use them apparently. We've still got them, but we're not allowed to use them. You've got on my nipple! No. I haven't! Not on your. The sticky bit isn't on your nipple! Oh, that's close. Yeah, the sticky yeah. bit that isn't close. on your nipple. You went for it, didn't you? <laughs> no. That's better. Woo! <laughs> ow, 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 ow. No, 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 I need a minute. Look at your tummy. You look like a plucked chicken. <laughs> <laughs> Why is there so much hair? Why are you so hairy? <laughs> it didn't even come off. Half is still on. I felt that. I felt the you know, thing. I, it. <laughs> I am so pale. Ah, okay. Well, there we have it. That was Matty's waxing situation. He's nice and waxed now. I'm ready to go and yeah we will be competing tomorrow so make sure you cheer us on from wherever you are in the world go team gb and i will see you on the flip side yes yeah, i'll be posting exactly. a video right after the competition just about how it went so yeah it's kind of crazy to think that the next video after this we would have competed in the first competition so peace out peace love rubber ducks i don't know bye everyone bye bye ah!
Ow, 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 ow. What? What? That was a really good one. Oh. <laughs>